Today we're doing another very large and a heavy Amazon custom return general merchandise liquidation mystery box. This box weighs 43 pounds. They're usually not this heavy. So I'm guessing there's something in here, like one item that weighs a lot in order to create this much weight in this box. But yeah, this box was around 250 bucks. It is Amazon custom returns. It could be used, it could be new, it could be lightly used. There's not much like trash in these boxes from this company that I'm buying from, but the large majority of items in this box are going to be in new or like new conditions still, which is fantastic. So hopefully we get at least a triple up. Not always, sometimes it's just a double up, but the boxes are always profitable. It's customer returns. So you ready to do this? Let's see what we got going on with this box. Hopefully it's a good one. So this is general merchandise, which means it could be sporting goods, toys, housewares, electronics, collectibles, pretty much anything that you can imagine, it can be in this box. And like I said, this box is kind of heavy. So I'm very curious what is creating all this weight in this box. Hopefully it's not like a, like a 20 pound bag of dog food or something. It, it's possible though. Hopefully not, but right on top, I see some AirPods. They're on top of the box. That's what we're seeing. Let me set this thing down next to me. We'll get going. Right on top of the box, we'll do it first. We got AirPods. These are, looks like this is the original AirPods. Yeah, the original, the first AirPods. Yeah, these have gone down in value a little bit or resale value. But still like, I think like 30 or 40 bucks though. And they are kind of dirty. They got some ear wax in them. Kind of dirty, kind of gross. Put them back. But yeah, these have to be deep cleaned and sanitized, but it is sellable. It will sell. Here we go next. Nice Cardia Mobile. We've gotten a few of these in the past couple months. Okay, next item. We have a mini anti-barking collar. Kind of worthless. Also, below in the description box of the video, there's going to be a direct link to our eBay store. Right now, there's over 1,400 items available for sale right now. A lot of items available for sale, all the way from, uh, you know, like I said, sporting goods, electronics, toys, all kinds of goodies. Make sure you check it out. Let's see. We have a power bank, a two-pack power bank, off-branded, though. Still probably good 20 bucks, though. Okay, I'd see a mystery item in this box. Oh, okay. Never mind. I saw the case. That might be something kind of cool. A mystery kind of an item. And we have... Oh, upside down. Other way. We have a off-branded like little little saw. Huh. Different. It, has no, it looks like a Black & Decker, but it's not Black & Decker. It's like completely off-branded. Has a replacement like saw blade in it. Okay, <laughs> it's a little, a little different. I probably won't be able to get this thing back in the same way now since I took it out. That's how it usually works. Take some out of the package. You will never get it back in the box the same way. We'll just leave it like that to work with that thing later. Okay, so what's causing the weight? I still don't see what's causing the weight in this box. Oh, this is a little bit of weight. What is this? Secure your dream. I don't know what this is. There's a little bit of weight. The brand is VZoom. Oh, it's broken. The whole face of this thing is completely smashed, cracked, and broken. So whatever this thing was, it's it's worthless now. That's why it got returned. It's broken. There's usually not a whole lot of like broken stuff in these boxes, but yeah, whatever that thing is, it is broken. So I'm not too sure what that is. 4K UHD, UHD Supreme Resolution. Maybe it's some kind of like a, a streaming oversized box or something. I don't know, but it's broken. It's kind of worthless, so that does stink. Let's see, we got a Gerber knife. Noise. It is not fighter seal, it's been opened up before. 
I do like Gerber knives. Might have checked this one out before I sell it to make sure I don't want to keep it. Sometimes I like keeping knives for business use. <laughs> Let's see, we have a two-line doubler for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System in 64. So just have like a two-line doubler. Okay, so far, nothing in this box is like, well, I mean, you had some AirPods and stuff, but so far, nothing like fantastic yet. Air suction beauty device. It's still, it's factory sealed. Packaging is a little bit, a little bit torn up, but still factory. Vacuum suction beauty device. Let's see, we have two re rechargeable walkie talkies. The brand is Top Top Sung. Never heard of them. Probably good, probably 30, 40 bucks though. Oh, that sounds loose. Wow, okay. Bluetooth smart lock, but it is all, uh, okay. It's all loose in the package. Looks like it's been previously installed. Yeah, it's kind of like scratched up. It might not have worked. That might've been why they returned it. I don't know, so far this box, I don't think I've even made my money back so far. No big ticket items yet. I mean, the AirPods like what, 40 bucks or so, but. ZZ Power NIMH batteries. Probably batteries for like, well, I bet you like laptop maybe. More likely. Yeah, probably like a laptop or something. Or actually, it might be for an, oh, these are for an RC car. Batteries for an RC car. Okay. I know a lot of RC cars take different kinds of batteries. I have several RC cars myself. And I know this won't fit any of mine, but some of the batteries can be like 30 bucks by themselves. So these batteries actually might be worth like 50, 60 bucks right there. It's possible. Let's see, what do we have here? Hornbill Smart Lock. So another lock set. At least this one doesn't seem like it's literally like round and round on itself. The other one, that was very loose and packed. Ooh, that one still looked all, that one's still all factory packaged. Let me just keep that, keep that in the box. A smart lock, key free, touch screen, fingerprint, anti-theft device. Let me actually look this thing up on eBay. Let's see if there's anything value to it. Hopefully it does, because we need some big ticket items. Hornbill smart lock. Uh, looks like it's about 50 bucks. I'm seeing a few sub between 50 and 60 for open box items. It's about 50 bucks, but it's not bad. A little bit of money right there. Not like a huge thing, but a little bit of money. Let's see. Oh, we have 6,000 count of little BBs for your BB guns. This had a little bit of weight. This is kind of heavy, actually. So we had crossbin copperheads. This is the brand I used to use back when I was a kid, I think, when I had a BB gun back when I was a kid. I think I used, I think it was Crossman's that I actually used too. I think it was, could be wrong. Charging pad, off-branded. Okay, we have power tool battery. Just a random loose battery in this box. And we, oh, this is a knife. That's that CVV brand. What kind of knife we have. Not bad. Some of these CVV knives have pretty decent value to them, too. That's not bad. I know we've sold a few for like 50, 50 60 bucks each. I don't see a model number on this knife. It's going to take a little bit of research to find this one. It is lightly used. It's, 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 it's not new. It's lightly used knife. But nice carrying case. It's like brand is C-I-V-I-V-I CVV. I think I said it right. See smart shock collar for your pet. Color changing upgraded light or something. It looks like an alarm clock, something. <laughs> see what is this? We have a mystery bag. No labeling, no nothing. What is in this? Hopefully it's like a Nintendo Switch. That'd be kind of incredibly awesome. And we have, 
What is this? Omron. Blood pressure monitor. It's the blood pressure monitor. Yeah, it's honestly, it's still probably be 30, 40 bucks though. It's still a little bit of value to it. But we just got a blood pressure monitor inside. You have the cuff and the uh, like the charger for it or the uh, the power adapter for it. So nothing crazy expensive in, in that mystery bag. Had me intrigued what it was though. I didn't even, it didn't even cross my mind that it might be like a blood pressure cuff. Didn't even cross my mind, but makes sense now when you look at the bag. Let's see, we're about done. We don't have very much stuff left. You have the 64-bit English Windows Pro. It's still factory sealed. We've sold a few of these on eBay the past few months. They actually sell halfway decent and the barcode's not scanning. Of course it's not. But I think it was like 50 or 60 bucks on the top of my head. I think that is what it sold for. Here we go. This is the last item. LED light bar. It's still factory sealed box. That's the original tape on there. Not the best packaging though, is it? LED light bar looks like for your Jeep. This has a barcode. Let me look at the barcode on the Amazon app again, see if it'll pull it up. And on Amazon, looks like it's about $27. So not very expensive. So that's it for this box. Not the best box this time. This was a, a lot of third party products. The only like name brand things, like name brand major market items was the AirPods and then this Windows software. I think that was about it. Oh, we had a Gerber knife, but of course it's not very expensive. This, yeah, this this box is just a third party product mystery box. So, eh, eh not the best. It'll still be profitable, but some of this stuff's gonna be slow sellers because, you know, I don't know who's gonna rush up to buy this from me. But anyway, everything in this video will be for sale in my eBay store. It might take a few days for it to get listed after this video, but everything will be for sale. And go ahead and check it out. There's like, what I say, over 1,400 items available. So I guarantee you there's something in there for everybody. So if you enjoyed this video, even though it wasn't the best liquidation box, feel free to go ahead, go down below, click that subscribe button. I upload this channel every single day. I have not missed a single upload on this YouTube channel in four years. Four years straight, no missed uploads. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.